mansplaining, manspreading, mandatory vaccines, <laughs> mandra. <laughs> I'm from Mandra. We got we get a bit of a bad rap down Mandra, but we got some good stuff going on down there. For example, we've got some beautiful white sandy beaches. Don't be fooled though, about 80% of that is the meth residue, so yeah. that's why I like to sunbake face down in Mandra. So, yeah. so a little bit about myself. Um, I'm single. I know it's surprising saying I look like um, Mr. Bean hate fucks guy Sebastian. <laughs> <laughs> I should be beating them off with a stick, right? Have you ever heard that saying before? You know, you should be beating them off with a stick. Why are you still single? Probably because I keep hitting girls with a fucking stick. <laughs> That's pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> but yeah, I've been single for a long time. I was complaining to someone recently because it's been a while. And they were just like, oh, you loser. You know, it's legal to pay for it. You should do that. I'm like, oh, what a great idea. Thanks, Mum. So, <laughs> I actually thought about it like long and hard, you know. And I, I don't think I could do it. I couldn't bring myself to um, pay for an escort, you know. And it's not because I'm against it or anything. Or it's definitely not because I have any self-worth, because that's not it. It's just that um, I don't want to be someone's bad day at work. You know what I mean? <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> Halfway through, they just audibly start going, think of the money, think of the money, do it for the kids, do it for the kids. My self-esteem can't handle that shit, you know? <laughs> uh, so, do we have any believers of ghosts in the house? Yeah. yeah, we've got some believers. I don't personally believe in ghosts. You know, it doesn't make sense to me because it's... Why are the ghosts always so well-dressed? Have you noticed that? They've always got like ball gowns on and top hats and shit. <laughs> and they've always got like a real romantic sad story around them. Like, don't go in that house. It's haunted by Mary. She was betrayed on her wedding day when her husband's secret lover stabbed her in the heart. And now she just sits in there wearing a wedding dress, <laughs> holding a bouquet, quietly sobbing. It's always something like that. It's never like, here's fat cunt Bob who died of a heroin overdose. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just hanging around. <laughs> a fucking Xbox is missing, by the way. <laughs> hearing that ghostly voice. Ooh, I'll suck your dick for ten dollars. <laughs> <laughs> Bargain's a bargain, what can I say? 